Okay, another beautiful day out in the back. Hi guys, thanks for tuning in. Um, today I've got the microphone on. I've been. I suppose sometimes I do talk when I'm writing, um, and I just noticed on the last couple of times when I didn't have the mic, a separate mic plugged in, it was very muffled. And then you kind of have this weird thing of um, do I try to drown out the talking with the music, or do I try to um, turn up the sound to get the muffled talking in? So just trying it with this mic. Okay, so it's oh, it's pretty slippy here today. Not sure if my writing in the ruts is a good idea, but let's see. <laughs> something I can get out of or not. Okay. Down here. Okay. So, this is definitely something that could be getting stuck in. Kind of looks like fun, but maybe not today. I haven't been out on this bike in a little bit, a couple of weeks, because I actually injured my knee on a mountain bike, uh, of all things. And uh, it's still a bit goosed, and I don't want to put pressure on it. Okay, so. So here's an example of turning using the clutch to control rather than the front brake. Now, let's see. In the rut. Are out of the rut. Uh, let's go in the rut. This is really slippery, but fun.
it's nearly easier in the rut because the bike isn't going to go anywhere in the rut it's going to bounce side to side because when I come out of the ruts I really am slipping Okay. No, no, no. Oh, stop, stop, stop. Okay. So we have the drone. It's looking to go home. Oh, this is no, no. Oh, there she is. Fella. battery in kind of actually they that's one thing about the drone batteries they do actually drain once you've charged them so if you charge them and then plug them out and don't use them for a few days the battery actually drains on them so
Okay, so the forecast was for no rain, which obviously just applies for everywhere else in Ireland except where I am. Anyway, I will be back up here a lot more during the summertime because there's a section up here that I cannot get to um, right now. But when it dries out, there's quite a lot more to explore here. Unfortunately, it's just too wet for the drone. Uh, it's just that constant drizzle. Uh, it's pretty heavy, so. Okay. I could have come down there. Maybe during the summertime I will. But, uh, it's not today. I kind of felt it on my knee there a minute ago when I was trying to turn the bike. So uh, I just feel if I did anything that was going to be too um, strenuous, I definitely wouldn't be up for it. So trying to lift the bike in an awkward area or something isn't really going to happen today. But it'll happen if it needs to happen. But oh, I don't want to be taking unnecessary risks. And yes, I do appreciate there, there is risk with riding on your own all the time, um, but what you can do is try to um, cover yourself the best you can. Now this is very tempting. Very steep, very rocky, and it is pissing rain now. Um, should I? Shouldn't I? Ding, 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 ding. Okay, there's quite a few guard um, ruts there. I'm gonna do it, not today. Um, I don't wanna screw my knee up because I will be out of action for another couple of weeks if I do. That is definitely on the to-do list for the CB500. So much to explore here. So, I know you, there isn't a huge, um, uptake on the enduro videos and that's fine and I appreciate the guys are just into certain things um, but it definitely allows me to explore areas that I probably wouldn't do on my own on the CB500X just from the point of view that if I got into trouble I wouldn't know if I could get out of or not so at least on the WR250 when I go exploring I can see what is and isn't doable on this bike then and come back I mean, one helps the other really. It, I know people kind of see them as different things, the enduro and the adventure bike and all that, but to be honest, for me, it's all motorbikes. I just love riding motorbikes. Just love riding motorbikes. Yeah. So, I mean, the enduro bike, the skills you need to work on for that, and the trials bike, they all translate to this and the stuff I'm doing here now that if I hadn't practiced it and learned the technique on a lighter bike I wouldn't be able to do it 